Okay. Okay, we just went shopping. <laughs> we left. It took us about an hour to find everything because I couldn't find what I wanted really, you know. It took us three hours to get through the line. I'm not joking, three hours standing in line. This is the water with this cuts. What's the water? Good. Okay. Go back on You wet this water in the powdered milk. We have no idea what, she, what each thing was individually. We got some diet soda pop. What the? Regular soda pop. And oil, because you can't get cooking spray, so you gotta have oil. Which, hopefully, I don't have to use much of it because I don't like this taste of burnt oil on the food, you know. A little bit of bread. Okay. Look at the small toilet paper. It's toilet paper? Yeah, this it's is small. This. this is like it's one roll. It's 32. Like one, this is like one roll in America. All this. Oh. Yes, this is all softed. And, okay. I'm going to have the way for now. A bag of rice, five kilos. That's 200 something. Yes, yeah, so 200 something. That'd be about four dollars. Mm. She got some candy bars, which are about the same price here in America, about a buck a piece. It's 55. It's one dollar. And we got some um, spices. We don't didn't have any spices, so and these ran. These were very expensive here. These ran about two dollars, three dollars a bot a thing of of it. Like got some garlic powder. Oregano, I think it's one dollar at that one. Yeah, something. Um, yeah. Ground pepper, and then we got some mayonnaise. We got mayonnaise and some. I believe it's gonna be Miracle Whip in here too. Like Miracle Whip, it says this. Um, this real mayonnaise. This is mayonnaise all-purpose dressing. I think it's like Miracle Whip. And when I make it, I, I use both in what I'm making. So, and then we got. Um, I got some spaghetti sauces. You don't want to make a sauce. I couldn't find exactly what I wanted, so I got two styles of sauce to put. The, to start me together, they got the other spices. And then we asked somebody, do you have diced tomatoes? They had no idea what diced tomatoes were. So he's never heard of such a thing, and no. I found diced tomatoes whole row over there, like five or six different brands. And these were about a dollar a can, so I get these about 67 cents in America. So these were about a dollar, there were 53 pesos for that, which is about a dollar, a little over a dollar. One dollar. Yeah. Um, these are potatoes, the biggest we can find. I don't know how much it cost. I didn't look. I was scared to. I think 100 something. And this, this was due. I paid 53 pesos or 55 pesos for this spaghetti. And, you know, it's um, about what I pay in America for, for spaghetti. I, I don't think it's that much cheaper here for the most part to eat because it's, it's so, so expensive. I don't know how much the salt was. I would have I done iodized sea salt. All you get is coarse sea salt iodized here. Um, Jenny needed cheese whiz for something. I like it. Um, this is about four dollars a can. More than I think it's more than I pay at home if I get it. I don't buy it very often, so I can't swear to that. But I don't think I pay four dollars a can for it. Um, these were red. Red um, uh, onions. onions. And how much were they? See there, they have tucked there. These were. Um, 0.244. So how much? 94 pesos. See? Yeah, because the that's, that's about four dollars. I could buy these in America. Because the kilo that one, it's three hundred something. Yeah, but I could buy these for a bag of um, about five of them in there for about two bucks, three bucks. These cost like twice as much and they're half the size. And I have no idea we paid for the little um, thing of mustard, but I needed to mix some stuff. This is some sweet um, pickles. Yeah, I wanted regular um, pickles, but all we can get is the, the cucumber type. But I'll have to make them, make them work for what I'm doing. And got this um, paprika. I had a hell of a time finding paprika. I don't know how much it was, but I didn't care. I was just kind of. And then the final thing, and this was exactly the same price I paid at home for it for some cranberries for, um, for one of our meals I'm making. And then another. This came to about $65. So you figure out it was actually cheaper for food wise here than it is in America. And what I'm seeing right here is, I don't think so. Some things are cheaper, but I think. Um, yeah, it depends. A lot, a lot of the stuff is a lot more expensive, harder to find, 
a lot smaller selection on everything. Unless you want soy sauce, you get 100 types of soy sauce. So, anyway, more to come. Take care.